Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, here to start the 13 Nights of Halloween. The thing I started doing last year, it's gonna start again. 13 Nights of Halloween themed games. Some of them horror, some of them just, in theory, Halloween related. And I'm starting it off with a special guest. Say hello to D-Free. What's up, man? Hello! It's been a very, it's been a very long time since you've been here. Um, yeah, it feels like it was just yesterday to me. Yeah, it's... <laughs> You know what? That's a testament to how fast time flies, man. It is true. It's flying very fast. I think the last time we were together, um, which make, that makes it sound weirder than it is, we were here to talk about <laughs> Bounty Rush. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, I always kind of am like taken aback by how fast time truly is passing because, you know, I look at my kids and they're just like shooting up. You know. Oh, oh yeah, that's gonna make it way faster. You're just gonna <laughs> one day you're like, oh, oh man, I was just recording the new EX Krillin, and now my son is graduating. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> or my daughter? Yeah, the kids I, are graduating. I hope, I hope it doesn't move that fast, but <laughs> yeah, you know, uh, they're not older, and you're still recording some Legends videos. Uh -huh. <laughs> you're gonna talk about Zenkai Two. You know what? Hey, if if that's the case, that means Legends has done pretty well for itself. You know what? That's very <laughs> true. That's very true. Oh man! But that's enough to talk about Legends. Let's talk about a true horror. Um, I brought you here to watch me play some Amnesia. The reason is is that I've actually bought this game a long time ago, have never okay. played it. The reason is is that I've always been told is extremely scary, um, and I'm a coward. Um, you can see actually any of my past videos where I played a actual scary game <laughs> where I literally wouldn't advance the game forward because I was like, oh, I think there's a ghost outside. Well, I'm not going to keep playing this game. Fuck that. I just I just stopped the video. You know, I never really got into scary games either. And I, I don't I'm not really like a huge like horror film person either. Mm -hmm. So like I'm kind of in the same boat as you. Probably not as bad as you, but... I never really got into it. It's not my motif, man. Yeah. Well, it's even worse for me because I actually am a big fan of horror. I'm just also chicken. <laughs> I don't like I don't like horror games where you can't fight back. I always think yeah. those are the, the worst for me. Um, yeah. Yeah, this one is one of those where you don't fight back. I, can I, am I already looking around? What the hell is going on here? I, I don't know how it's looking for you because I think I have you for having it like 15 frames per second. So this must look really weird. It's uh, it's, it's all right. It, it's it works. It's work. I can make it out. All I right. can read the subtitles. I can see it. I'm good. All right. Good. Good. Daniel. Okay. So I'm Daniel, even though I created a profile and said my name is Wokey. So I'm already out of the game. <laughs> I'm already not down with this. <laughs> All right, and pure pure darkness on the screen now. Okay, I'm gonna just try and move my head because that's the only thing I can do at the moment. What? Am I on the floor? Yeah, I'm on the floor. Oh, that or I'm on a horrible sideways. Okay, never mind. I don't I don't know what happened there. It looked like I was able to start walking. Um, Mental is sideways. Attitude. That would have been pretty bad, man. Maybe you had a sideways head. Oh no, thank you. I'd, if that was actually this entire game was me on my sideways head walking through a dark castle. <laughs> oh, a mento has right. been added to the journal. Oh, yeah. All right. So I think I can. Okay, I figured out how to crouch. There's a hand they, icon. They just throw you in without any like tutorial. I'm not used mm. to that. No, no, it's not not as far as I can tell. Apparently they just want me to walk around. There's a grab button, but I don't know which one is the grab button. Oh. I have, okay. It's the I've... one that says grab, Wokey. <laughs> <laughs> Let me look at my Xbox controller and pick the grab button and <laughs> see which one of those works out. Uh, funny enough, related to that, I've been trying to learn fighters because I need to get into a Dragon Ball game that isn't Dokkan or Legends to save my own sanity at some point. You know, the funny thing is I'm considering doing the same thing. <laughs> oh, really? If you yeah, ever, I want to uh, get into it. It's it's hard because you need someone into it, and then all the people who are into it, all they want to do is beat you. So <laughs> it's very hard to actually learn. Okay, yeah, I figured out how to go. You learn trial by fire, man. Yeah. But a lot, so I tried to be like, okay, so I'm gonna look up to see what combos are, and all of them are like, press the L button and press the he and press the H button. And I'm like looking at my controller, going, what, what the hell is the heavier whatever button? I don't, 
I don't understand any of this. I just get angry and look away and go, I'm just gonna press buttons and hope I win online. And I've won oh, twice. So a And I've won twice. There you go. <laughs> Imagine being that guy. Oh, I, I felt bad for that guy because I, I completely whooped his ass. It was uh, it's not a fair fight. Uh, I know enough about fighting games because I used to play Marvel vs. Cat. What the hell? I'm. What is going on? What the fuck? I'm on the floor again. Somebody got into liquor cabinet. <laughs> yeah, this guy's actually just waking up from a horrible hangover. <laughs> He's rolling. He's rolling. Oh, is that hard. blood on the floor? I. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, it landed perfectly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh yeah, I can see why people like this game so much now. That, that was actually nope. kind of awesome. Nope, it's it, nope. That that's when I leave, man. It landed oh, perfectly. Oh hell no. Oh haunted chair. Yeah, yeah, I'm done. You know what? Fucking done with you, chair. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of my sight. I don't need any haunted chairs. Actually, that would actually freak me out if a chair landed perfectly on something. Wait, I would think. Yeah, exactly. How does that even happen? What are the odds of that? It is impossible. The really nice t-shirt. Can't pick that up, though. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna keep on moving forward. Because that's all I can really do. Well, in. Of course, the second I look at the picture of the happy white people, everything goes bad. <laughs> <laughs> Beware, when like, standing in darkness, you're standing... Up, man. The, yeah. Turn on the lights in the environment using the tinder boxes and search for other light sources. Okay, so apparently I'm losing my mind by. Li okay, so I'm gonna avoid that because it's super dark. So I'm not. Gonna <laughs> I'm just not going in there anymore. I hope you weren't interested in what those paintings look like because we're never going back in there. Oh my god. All right, I figured out how to get to an old archive. We figured it out. <laughs> Travel to the Dover Met, going through Canebury. You made sure to pay a visit to avoid the sense of guilt connected with neglect. So you're okay. saying we beat the game. I'm, yeah, this is the victory lap. Start playing the Final oh, yeah. Fantasy music because we're what the witnessing unsettling events will reduce your sanity. What? Shit. All right. I'm making progress. What They're does trying. Sanity mean? Is there like there's like no meter on your screen to show you like your sanity or whatever? Does it just mm. get fuzzy or whatever? Yeah, it just gets fuzzier. My character seems like not okay with anything going on. Yikes. It does exactly. kind of. It, it actually is getting harder and harder to control this person, because I have like no. Yeah, like every like bugs. Like yeah. what the hell? Where did they go? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's no. going on. I'm gone. Let me out. Yeah, if I was this guy, they're mi they're missing the part. He's like dead silence watching all this. That would not be me. All right. Well, hopefully I didn't need any of those boxes because they're gone now. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try going back into the darkness and see what I can find. All right, let's see. I need to find some light. Okay, okay, here, here's some light. I should be able to be recover a little bit here, get some sunshine, get some photosynthesis, be okay up in here. Mm, there was some in that room where you were throwing the box. Well, what actually. the fuck was that a person there? Did you see that? I looked away for like a half second, man. Shit. Well, now I don't oh, know shit. if there was actually legitimately a person or I just like. Could it? Oh man. Later book. <laughs> I really hope there's not a point where I have to actually read any of this. <laughs> Are you just picking up random stuff? I am just no. kind of picking up random stuff and tossing it and seeing if that will help. Oh, That's here's a lantern. Cool. Okay. Oh, All now right, you we... can go down that super dark room that you had. I'm gonna be real here. I'm not going back any dark rooms anytime soon. <laughs> We're trying to get the hell out of here as quickly as possible without any sign of uh, discomfort. So is that the purpose of the game? Trying to get out? I think so. Based off the name. Okay, I was freaking out, so I'm putting out my nightlight. Just to stop everything from going bad. Okay, let's see. All right, I should be safe near a fire. Apparently not. I'm gonna, even though there's literally fire right in front of me. Oh wait, a can of beans. Tinder boxes Tinder box. are used to light sources. Uh, the current number of tinder boxes shown. Okay. Okay, so I can I've use it. I've never heard to... of a tinder box. I've never either. This is apparently just a bunch of old. 
Okay. I mean, you have a freaking lantern. Yeah, this takes place in, like, the ancient times, or probably current-day Romania or something. I have no <laughs> idea. <laughs> you have a freaking lantern. I think that's a pretty telling uh, thing there. Yeah. Oh, I found something. Oh, there we go. 1839. Oh, yeah, this is old-ass time. Don't be afraid, Daniel. Yeah, he got as drunk as hell, according to this uh, letter here. He did say he drank something. The way he was rolling, man, I knew it. <laughs> Started off freaking sideways. 1983 version of Hennessy, he just drank it all, and now he's in a spooky <laughs> castle. Alexander of Brennenberg? Yeah, these are, this is back when people didn't have last names. This is uh, an extremely long time ago. <laughs> His body is old and it's eighteen thirties, man. Young and yeah. He will be no I kind of I kinda of wish I would go back to the old old because then now nowadays I would be called like Wookie of YouTube. That would be my old <laughs> <laughs> my old timey name. Wookie of the YouTubes. Wookie of the Dragalia, of course. <laughs> well known within our <laughs> within our community. Oh my god. Redeem us both, Daniel. Into a darkness. Into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. All right, so we're just here to kill someone. Wait, was this a letter to me? What the? F okay, I got some oil. No, I'm gonna put this away now. Let me see. Ooh. <laughs> Spooky. I think I have to do this because if I use too much of my lantern, what's going to end up happening is that I'm going to be lost in the dark and fuck up something along the way. Sounds uh, about Wookie. Yeah, that does sound right about me. <laughs> this guy really has no qualms with just fucking up everything. What does this book say? <laughs> he just throws stuff just because he can, man. Yeah. He's like, actually, yeah, that's what actually, stuff. It is really. Oh, oh, I got this. I solved your damn puzzle. Watch this. Easy. All right, now into the dark, <laughs> into the dark, spooky shit. As we go further uh, deep, there's rats. I'm not down with rats. I did. Uh, no, I have obviously I haven't told you the story. One time I woke up for um, I was going to a uh, Yu-Gi-Oh tourney with a friend, so I stayed over at his house. And mm -hmm. when I went, we woke up at like uh, 4 a.m. because it was like a trip to the L.A. Convention Center and it was pretty far away. <laughs> and when I went to go put on my shoe, I felt something and I took off my shoe. There was a, a, a mouse inside my shoe. <laughs> wow, that would freak me the hell out, man. It did. And then what followed was my friend's dad Alexander, taking a hammer and then killing it off screen. <laughs> it was like, is it going to be OK that I hear? I'm like, nope. That answered my question. I don't even know what to say that one, man. Yeah, it's fucked up. You know, it's a spooky month. I'm telling you some horror stories. <laughs> That's brutal. I, I wouldn't even have wished that on the mouse. No, not even. I was like, <laughs> live and let live, man. <laughs> and then the scariest pack ever, because it was the, the pack that had cyber dragons in it. What is this? What is it called? Yeah, it was a long for a back. It is the toughest planet and can be torn by hand or tools. Can I put you it on use fire? Can I put you on fire? Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna go find something to see if I can put it on fire. That doesn't look like anything, uh, human. Yeah, that's pretty free. Freaky. Yeah, no, no thank you. I also can't run. Which is another reason why I think I ended up not playing it, because I was like, what? Well, if a spooky shit happens that I can't run away- What is that? Was there something there? Nope. Alright. You're you're my backup on this, so if you see anything spooky, you have to tell me. Okay? I didn't control oh. that. That was literally something taking control away from me, telling me to go down here. So I guess I'm really? gonna go down here. Yeah, <laughs> it literally took control away from me, because I was like, I'll go up, and then it was like, nope. Go over here. <laughs> I was like, okay. No, you're not going up. At least they help you with the puzzle. So you don't they just did wander help. aimlessly. Uh, yeah, that or maybe I'm being led to my death. It's very hard to tell in the current stage of the game. <laughs> Either one's good with me. I, I think you deserve to die if you go that way. Oh, you know what? Thank you. This is why I brought you here. I needed someone who was actually against my side the entire time I was playing. <laughs> Looking out for your best interests, man. Yeah, in the interest thank of the channel, entertainment, yeah. you know, all that. 
Oh no, you're right. The 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 more entertaining, the better. Okay. Yeah. I think this thing is shouting at me. What? What is going yeah. on here? All right. This Seems... thing in this basement. Yeah, not not a fan of the basement. Why did I go down here? What? Okay, wait, no. That's just. What the hell a is that? A bunch of dead rats. Ugh, no, no, oh god. I gotta get the hell out of here. Oh wait, there's something for me. Yeah, I picked up some oil. Okay, I thought I could open that cabinet. I could not actually open that cabinet. I'm gonna put out the lantern now, because now I feel like something's gonna- What? Oh, you can't hear that, but something's talking to me. I kinda hear it, but I can't make it out. Really? Yeah, I kinda heard it. Okay, so I'm gonna go down here where I heard the spooky voice. That turned off my lantern. What the, what the fuck? Is there something down here? Yeah, there's something down here. Okay. So I'm not going down that hole anytime soon. Ah! Am I losing my mind? There should be more Kubrat. What the fuck is Kubrat? <laughs> I don't know what the hell that means. Oh, okay. So maybe someone's making a spell of some kind? Where the hell am I? Ah! It's so bright! It is insanely bright. Oh, wait, I found it. Boom. Chemical relocation. The lack of a chimney to probably vent the fumes from my most- Oh, I've been just uh, smoking some fumes? <laughs> That's what's been going on here. <laughs> it's taking its toll on many of my less stable ingredients and storage. Seems some unaffected, but many are stained with the fumes and will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can to move them to the wine cellar. Okay. I don't have any tinder boxes. Is that oil? That's oil. There's no oil left, and you need to put, find an oil potion to use it to make the lantern work again. Oh, that doesn't sound very good for me. So that just means I'm just gonna slowly lose my mind until I find the right thing to. This is my third attempt to produce artificial vitae. The formal compounds lack the potency I need, and since I'm close, calamine and oropins are a given, and the culprit binds them well. This time I will attempt aqua regine instead of aqua fortis in hopes it will produce a much more. Uh, even more solution. The experiment was unsuccessful. The solution is highly acid and proves impractical to put any use except a detergent. Organic tissue react. Does any of this make sense to you? It just sounds like science talk to me. Yeah, it's something that's going way over my head, man. Yeah, that is, uh. I'm gonna touch this real quick. There we go. Yeah, more tinder boxes. I need to find a light source real quick before I think my guy just starts losing his mind. Because he's currently not like having a good... fuzzy for you? Yeah, it's extremely fuzzy. It's making it very hard yeah, for me to find it's... anything. There well, so, we like, go. take that and amplify it by, like, probably, like, <laughs> three for me. So, like, for me, I could tell it's kind of fuzzy for you because it gets really fuzzy for me. <laughs> You're, for you, it's, like, uh, an insane amount of fuzz. <laughs> All right. That's not what I need because I can throw it away. <laughs> what? Oh, shit, it fell down there. I can put stuff down the hole. Well, let's see if that works out for me in the end. Nope. Well, hopefully I didn't need any of that because it's gone now. Put it down here, maybe. It's, something's climbing up the stairs. I didn't see anything. You didn't see anything, but I definitely heard someone climbing up those stairs. So I'm going to probably have to go back up there. Also, I should actually cut the episode off here before it becomes too big for me to upload in my very small amount of <laughs> mobile data that I have. So we'll climb up the stairs and we'll continue this on the next episode. Why don't you say goodbye to the people, D-Free? Thanks for having me, man. I appreciate it. And guys, bye.